Hi everyone, Carlin from HP here. Today I want to tell you about HP's latest business notebooks powered by Intel 11th Gen Core processors with Iris XE graphics. There are some fantastic performance improvements, new features, and the exciting integration of AI technology. Last year when HP introduced the EliteBook 1030 X360G7, there were some major changes made to the design of the device. Bezels around the display were significantly trimmed down for a better screen-to-body ratio, giving you a smaller notebook that fits easily in your bag without compromising the size of the screen. Certain buttons that were typically dotted around the chassis, like the power button and the fingerprint scanner, were also recessed into the keyboard to reduce the size of the notebook without simply removing features. All of these changes were made to provide users with a new level of mobility so that whether you're currently working from home, the office, or anywhere in between, you're not restricted by a bulky device. So that was the G7 model. But what about the EliteBook 1030 G8? Well, all of the improvements that I mentioned in the G7 have been retained in the G8, but this time around, HP is focusing on what we can achieve under the hood. So let's talk performance. When it comes to the new 11th generation core processors, Intel is promising up to 24% increase in performance. There is also a big jump up when it comes to frequency with options up to 4.8 gigahertz. These new chips feature new memory controllers for faster RAM, as well as new display pipes, media encoders, and even integrated Thunderbolt 4. And of course, new Iris XE graphics, which will allow up to twice the frame rate of the Ice Lake or previous 10th gen equivalents. The fact that you now also have Thunderbolt 4 means that you can output to much higher resolution displays. One Thunderbolt 4 port can connect to up to two 4K DisplayPort or HDMI monitors at 60 FPS through a compatible dock or adapter. Now, this new range of Elite Books are smaller than we've ever seen them. And it's important to note that ultra-thin, ultra-light, ultra-portable devices often compromise on things like cooling, which completely defeats the purpose of all of these performance improvements from Intel. Thankfully, HP has opted to maintain a dual fan cooling system to ensure that users stay as productive as possible. And then there's this whole AI thing. Right now, it sort of feels like AI is being implemented into every aspect of new tech. We're already seeing AI in collaboration tools like Teams or Zoom to blur your backgrounds on video calls. It's also in other applications to upscale photos, automatic cropping and subject tracking for video editing. Some apps are even using AI to recognize actors in movies and TV shows to tell you who they are. Even all of the face filters that people use on Instagram or Snapchat are AI driven. But Intel is now engineering its latest processors specifically for all of our AI needs. The new EliteBook 1030 G8 has added a bunch of new features that leverage artificial intelligence to make life a little bit easier. One such feature is HP Context Aware, which uses a couple of sensors and some basic AI to detect if your device is put in a bag, on a tabletop, or on your lap, and it optimizes the thermals. So no more hot notebook on your bare knees when you're working on the couch in the scorching summer. Another feature is HP Dynamic Audio, which uses AI to recognize whether you're on a conference call, listening to music, watching a video. It then adapts and tunes your audio automatically. HP EliteBooks have used audio profiles in the past, but this is the first time AI has been implemented so that you don't have to change these profiles yourself. The number of these AI-driven features across a range of applications are only going to keep growing, and this is where Intel's 11th gen core processors will give you that edge. You don't technically need Intel 11th gen to use these new features, but what they will do is offload the AI computing from the main CPU to the built-in AI engines, freeing it up to focus on more important tasks that you need it for. With the benchmarks that Intel have released, they're promising up to four times the machine learning performance of its competitors. So there you have it, up to 24% higher performance and up to twice the frame rate versus previous 10th generation CPUs. The EliteBook 1030 G8 is engineered with a CPU built for our AI future, enabling new features that future versions of us will look back on as the start of the modern PC. That's it from me, everyone. 
Stay tuned for more videos from HP, but until then, take care and stay safe.